Right, this is some of the ones that we're going to be putting on eBay tonight. Uh, this Transit Connect Escort vehicle for abnormal loads fitted with beacons. If I turn that upside down, it's got ones in the grill as well. Uh, so that's uh, Oxford Diecast 176. I'll switch that off. Eddie Stobart Brick Lorry. That's fitted with beacons as well on the cab unit. I've also made it a movable high up held down with magnets so it won't be easily lost so, turn that around let you see a bit more of it there we go this will sit right to the back like that it's just a matter of pushing it along there we go We've also got the Jenkinson Euroforest. Once again, that's also fitted with beacons. As you can see, it's also got a posable high up. This has got a resin printed grab on it to make it look a bit better. So that's totally plausible as well. Just difficult to try and do things with one hand here. So if I put that back up over. That's a uh, Herpa high up. Uh, just been painted up and like I say, fixed it up there with with a resin printed grab. Switch these lights off. Now I custom make the trailers and paint them, and we also custom make the log bars as well. They're all made out of plastic art, which we laser cut. Then I respray the trailer, as you can see, nice glossy finish on the trailer. So, the next one is Innovate Logistics. Really like the colour of this, so we thought we'd do one. Uh, as one guy said, because Stobart bought them out quite a few years ago, uh, as a rare Stobart truck. Well, a rare Stobart Code 3. So, and I very much doubt if we'll be making another one. Uh, this will be the only one that we'll ever do. So that's the uh, that's, uh, trucks and that that we're going to be putting on eBay tonight. There is another one. Just about forgot about that one. I'll let you see around the layout a wee bit. Well, I'll go and pick it up. The other one is... It's just a standard Stober MAN named Molly Ann. And what I've done is I've weathered this one up. It actually looks really good when it's sitting on a layout. Just it's got a nice weather to it, nice dust. Just like road grain. So that's it for the the eBay items. I'll let you see some of the other items that we're working on just now. Working on this tipper as well. Uh, it's got a, a 3D printed body on it just now. We are doing a, a resin printed body. And as you can see, it does tip. 
but it is still work in progress anyway. As you can see, the reason why we want to do it at resin is because with a 3D print it gives you the grainy effect. That's a resin printed back door that I've just blue tacked on there for the time being. We have also done resin printed this. So that's a Guinness tanker. Uh, res my son designed and resin printed it. I've put running gear on it. I've put running gear on it as you can see and it's not going on eBay. These other ones that we're showing you just now, I'm showing you at the moment, they're not going on eBay just now. They might be going on in the future, not sure yet. Uh, there's a recovery truck. Thought I'd do a Scanny T-cab recovery. So that's going to get some smart looking decals on it and we'll get it, the light bar and all that done on it. So that's quite a smart looking one. Just thought I'd play about with that one today. Uh, heavy haul. This is a future eBay one. It's to get the crane on the back of it, yeah. Uh, working light bar as well. And then I'll have to move the fifth wheel coupling back. And I'll put the checker decking in. So that is a future one. This one here, if I can get out of the workshop. Uh, got asked to do another blue stream for a guy, so that's the start of his blue stream. That's all painted up so far. So we'll get the rest of it done. Uh, things just take time, <laughs> so we'll get that one finished off for him eventually. And that was a transit van that I had a bit of play about with. Thought, let's see if we can get a transit and open the bonnet up. <laughs> and we did. So, just been playing about with that. This one. Uh, I'm hoping to do this. <laughs> the Gold Rush one. Blackwood's Gold Rush. Uh, going to have to try and contact them. See if we can get any better images for it though. If we can get some nicer images, that'll be good. So that's the plan for that one. Put that back. And I think that's about all we're working on at the moment. There are a lot of things in the pipeline. Uh, just a matter of getting around to them, getting them done. But as usual, there's nothing going on in the layout. Layout is an absolute mess because we're too busy doing all this stuff. Uh, that's a Merseyside helicopter going to be. Just busy doing that for a guy just now. So that's waiting for its decals. I'll just swing you around. There's nothing else really happening. I'm trying to work on the layout. I'm trying to get bits and pieces done. We're new port of cabins that we're doing. Uh, we're doing it with ladders. My son's making me a new workshop because the workshop that we've got just now isn't quite big enough. So we're wanting this one to take complete trucks. So that's a new workshop that we're busy making at the moment. Uh, trying to do that in between jobs, which believe me is not very easy. Loading ramp there for loading trains on the back of the Oxford diecast. Low loaders. Uh, sold a few of these. Hopefully we'll get a video of one actually driving up. <laughs> it looks smart when it's driving up. There's an uh, port of cabin that we've done there. So, as you can see, not a lot has been going on. Uh, not got a lot of new toys. I think the last new toy was that Plaza Camp that we got. I have got some network rail wagons. If I can turn the camera around, as you can see, some network rail wagons down there. So we have been printing off uh, 176 scale caravans. 
There's two that are ready to go out for delivery there. They're quite smart. We're resin print them. And there's my, that's my little pride and joy. That's my uh, Blue Stream. I love that truck. Uh, it's got its driver and it's also got a second man in there. That's resin printed uh, exhaust stacks that we make up as well. Well, actually, we're selling them on our Facebook shop. I'll let you see the Braveheart one. That's a smart truck as well. So, that's a few of the things that we've got going on just now. But, that was just a quick uh, view also of the ones that we're putting on eBay tonight. So, not really much a uh, update, but... For the state of the layout, and that, that's the best that I can do just now. So, hope you've enjoyed it. And if you're looking for any of these ones on eBay, happy bidding. Uh, I'll be setting them off at a reasonable price. And hope you enjoyed the video. And I hope to get some more up soon. Okay, thank you. Bye.